definitely laundry catch up day today so I'm gonna have to get these into the wash <laughs> yeah it's a good place to take a nap too Roscoe we got to do laundry you got to move Doing a little bit of natural peanut butter. This is the Members Mark, by the way, from Sam's Club. And just some sandwich slims. This is breakfast. This is a workout day, so I am getting ready to go lift. And it's a little early in the morning, so I gotta have breakfast. This is probably about a tablespoon of natural peanut butter. Hey everyone, it's Vicki Marie and I want to welcome you back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm putting out a video every single day in April. So be sure and like, subscribe, and ring that bell if you want to make sure you don't miss an upload. Today I want to share three resources with you. Uh, they are resources that I have personally found uh, very inspiring. I have been following a couple of people, well quite a few, a number of people on YouTube and I like to share uh, resources with people that I think might help. Um, so now I know what my uh, my own fitness and health journey uh, was very unique to me. It was based on my own personal needs, and you know where I was on my journey. So not only the, my physical uh, health, um, you know my in my particular case, I had uh, blood pressure that was out of control. I had to go on medication for a year and I had to do something. I, I was 30 pounds heavier than I am now. My, my journey was unique and for me, I hired a personal trainer. I highly recommend it. In order to do that, I did um, do make some changes in my budget to make room for that. It was something I really did not want to spend the money on. Frankly, I thought hiring a trainer, why pay someone, I can go and look on the internet and, and get the information. All I have to do is do it. Certainly I could do it. I, all I got to do is show up in the gym. And I showed up in the gym for a whole year uh, with my husband and he went to do his workout. I had to do the, tr the treadmill in the corner of the gym. I didn't want to be seen. I just wanted to get in there, get 30 minutes of cardio, do a little bit of light lifting on what I call light lifting on the Nautilus machine and get out of Dodge. That was my workout plan. And I did that for a year for three to four times a week. And at the end of that year, I had hardly anything to show for it because I really didn't make adjustments in my diet. Yeah, well, yes, I did. I'll tell you what I did. Instead of eating full fat ice cream, I switched to skinny cow ice cream sandwiches. But you know what? I ate three of them instead of one. I mean, seriously. That's the kind of changes I was making in my diet. It wasn't working, even though I was getting a lot of exercise. I had to do something, so I hired a trainer, and that was really, really great because uh, that gave me my life back. She uh, worked with me face to face, and I made, and she helped me with my nutrition because she does do uh, coaching for nutrition. So, um, so after working with her for. Um, March through August, at the end of August, so March, five months, I had met all of my goals. So I had at that time lost 20 pounds in that time and cut my fat uh, body mass down to, I don't know, I think it went from like 30 to under 20% or around 20%. And then I, I, I kept going with that. So I accomplished more after that. But it took me through August when I uh, went to my doctor um, and he told me, and this was a year and a half ago, he said, whatever you're doing, keep doing it because you are, we're taking you off your medicine. You don't need your blood pressure medicine anymore. I was so happy um, because that was my goal. I didn't want to be on blood pressure medication. I didn't want to die of a massive heart attack at 54 like my dad did. So um, I'm 53 now. So I, uh, my fitness journey was unique to me and it helped and it worked for me. And when people ask me, how did you do it? I give them my phone, the phone number to my personal trainer. I realized that everybody has their own journey. So I wanted to just share a few resources with you guys because you might be on a different journey than I am. And I've come across three really great uh, resources right here on the YouTube community that I am inspired by. And I wanted to just share them with you guys. So um, that's what I'm going to do. So stay tuned. I'm going to uh, give a shout out to three uh, three uh, recommend uh, the three resources here that I highly recommend and I just recommend that you go and subscribe to their channel 
So, all right, there's a little tease because now I want to switch really quick and I want to tell you guys um, about my hummingbird um, feeders. I finally filled them up for the first time last night. I'm jumping the gun a little bit because um, I'm in Colorado and I checked the migration map and the hummingbirds are in northern New Mexico uh, right now. I'll put the link to that map here in my video too in case you guys want to follow that. I really like that map. It, it helps me to determine when to put my feeders out. So I put my feeders uh, out last night. I put two of them out. I uh, made my little hummer juice as I like to call it and I put it out and um, it'll probably, it might even be a week before I get a hummingbird, but I wanted to be ready because this is, you know, the time when they are going to migrate in and they're going to come passing by. And now I don't get a, a great big, huge amount of hummingbirds, mind you. I'm uh, about a 30 to 40 minute drive uh, east of the Rocky Mountains. So, but right now I'm looking for the the black chinned hummingbird. Um, I'll get a couple of those that come through. We'll get a couple of other ones as well, but I'll, I'll keep you posted. So you guys are probably gonna hear more about hummingbirds every day because I love hummingbirds. So I'm gonna show you uh, a little bit of the hummingbird feeder. I've got two of them hanging out here in my yard and uh, I'll add more as the time goes by. All right, my priorities uh, for this month in April is to work out four to five times a week. That's a huge priority of mine. Uh, it's, um, I can manage three times a week and my trainer uh, had switched me when I was working with her uh, at the very end. She had given me a set of workouts that were interval, inter interval training. So it was uh, doing like lifting, weight lifting with core abs kind of all blended in and some cardio. So I would do a burst of burpees or um, things like that, uh, um, just jump squats in between my lifting. It was challenging for me. In fact, it was so challenging that I went back to my previous workout at three, work, lifting three days a week. And I decided in April, I'm going to jump on and tackle that interval, wor the interval workouts. So I'm going to commit to doing four to five uh, workouts a week of interval training. I'm going to blend my cardio, um, abs, and my workouts all in one. And if you guys want to know more about interval training, there's certainly a lot of videos here and I am going to give you guys a link um, to sh so uh, I, I found a, a personal trainer online that puts out some really great information so uh, anyway I'll, I'll give you guys that link too in my uh, my video here I'll tell you about that in a minute um, but I um, am working on the interval lifting so today I'm going to do it about be it'll take me about an hour to an hour and 15 minutes so that's really my commitment is I work out about an hour to hour and 15 minutes. That includes my cardio and I do that four to five times a week. That's my commitment in April. So you can hold me accountable for that. If you guys are working on a workout routine and you want to stick to it in April, uh, since I am putting out a video every day in April, participating in VEDA, um, there's a, a number of other people who are doing this too. This is sort of coming from Lori Fluffy Nomo's channel. She uh, put the shout out to for people who wanted to vlog every day in, in April. Her, um, Anthony uh, McNett, uh, Strongman Lifestyle, he's doing it. Um, there, if you guys are doing it, let, it, let me know in the comments too. Uh, and this is, um, you know, this is sort of a challenge that Lori Fluffy Nomo puts out. And I like to participate uh, in challenges. It keeps me, it, it just keeps my routine fresh, you know, and keeps me, um, it keeps it fun. So, yeah. So let me know if you guys are doing VEDA. Uh, I love to just, you know, keep this going as a sort of mastermind community, give shout outs and include you guys in the videos and make it more, a little more interactive. So that's why I'm going to, again, be giving you the, um, three channels I want to uh, recommend to you if you are on a fitness uh, journey. All right, for the rest of this week, I've got to do taxes. I have not done my taxes yet. <laughs> that is true. Oh, I'm putting that off. So I've got to do uh, taxes still. So I'm going to be sitting down and doing that sometime this week. Oh, you can hold me that. So have you, have you guys done your taxes yet? <laughs> if you were like me and you've put it off, let me know that too. Let's just air our dirty laundry, right? Oh, speaking of dirty laundry, I need to go reboot mine. I'll be right back. Okay, 
So I am going to go get my workout done and um, I'll just give you guys a really quick little glimpse of that. laundry going and my goal today is to get that puppy done complete so really excited about that and I got my workout done now I might get on those taxes but I'm probably going to wait uh, for a couple of days oh it's just something I just keep procrastinating about probably because we don't really expect any money back and we don't really expect to owe so it's you know it's just something I've got to sit down and do so Anyway, all right, guys, now I want to uh, get to those three resources I promised you. Now, I um, shared a little bit today about my journey, and you guys can go check out my videos to just see more about that. But um, whatever journey that you are on as far as trying to improve your life or get fit or start a weight loss program or whatever it is, I... Um, there's a lot of ways to tackle that and so these resources are very different so let me just start with the first one okay i have never done hcg i just never have it's something i don't really ever plan to do but i have several friends who have done hcg it's a weight loss sort of protocol which i don't know a lot about except that i have friends who've tried it now I'm not recommending that you try it at all. I am not a healthcare professional, but if you are thinking of doing HCG, and I'm not you know, here to, to say one way or the other what you should do, but if it's something that you're thinking of doing, I recommend that you go on over to Lori Fluffy Nomo's channel because she has, um, she's actually done HCG. She's been on YouTube for quite a while. And she actually walks you through every detail of what it's like. And she does it um, by showing you her own experience. I mean, she's literally, you're going to walk with her. And I follow her and she's one of my, I mean, I watch her every day so that she puts a video out. So um, even though I'm not doing HCG, her and I have other things in common. So I like to watch her. So I recommend that you go on over to her channel. If you're considering doing HCG, that's one way one road you can take on the way to weight loss. So that's a great thing if that's if you're interested. Make sure you do your research though and consult your doctor because obviously I'm not one. Anyway, all right, now let me get to the second resource. All of these will be in links down below uh, this video. My second resource I want to share with you today is, um, now this is somebody I've been following for a little while too uh, on my channel and it is Polk Fitness. John Polk uh, Fitness, his, his channel is Polk Fitness, his name is John. He has a lovely family and he does a lot of, he, he does a lot of video creation, which I'm very interested in and I've learned a lot from watching his videos. But what I really, really wanted to share with you is um, now because I had success on my journey because I hired a personal trainer. That's what I did. Now, if you want her number, feel free to let me know, but you know, go over to Instagram, I'll, she's over there, and I will gladly send you her way. But um, John Polk is offering, he has a YouTube channel, and he does all kinds of videos on um, like um, exercise, and I really like the macro nutri nutrition um, that he, he actually walks you through what that actually means, which I really appreciate. So that's really helped me. Even though I learned so much from my trainer, I still have to sustain. And I, I go to YouTube channels and listen to people and resources all the time to help me learn even more just so I can sustain my journey. So he's offering, uh, and I'm not kidding you, free, completely free. You can go to him. 
uh, just go over to his channel uh, and I think he'll link you to his website too. You can go to his website, but you'll find it through his channel, which you'll find the link below. Um, and just click and um, he's offering a free, uh, to, to actually customize your weight, uh, your exercise program, plus your uh, macro nu nutrients, what you should be eating for weight loss, which I think is phenomenal. To do that for free, that's amazing. So of course I wanna share that with you. I don't know how long he's going to be doing it, but I know as of the, the today, when I'm putting this video out, he's doing this. So if you guys have been wanting to talk to somebody about a customized plan, go on over to uh, Polk Fitness and check out what he's offering over there because I just think that's phenomenal. That's what really helped me. And I love my trainer, but you know, I. Um, he's offering this whole free thing. So I want you guys to uh, just be able to have access to that if it's something that you're interested in. All right, so that's another way that you can lose weight. But the third resource that I can't, I'm just excited to share with you is this is totally different. Now, if you're just wanting to stay motivated at home, you kind of have a plan, you're, you've been going a while, you know what to do, but you're just, you just feel isolated and you're just sort of looking to connect with a community and you want to just, um, you know, find some friends to, to help you. And uh, so I have another recommendation. So my third recommendation is Princess Ninja. She is somebody who I've been following on YouTube and she just cracks me up. All of these three YouTubers are, are great. Um, now, uh, Princess Ninja, her name is Melanie Hines and she does keto, but even if you're not doing keto, um, she's doing in April, she's starting this whole thing where it's Move It Monday, that whole song, which I'm not even gonna sing to you, go over to her channel and she'll sing it for you. <laughs> but um, she's doing a Move It Monday, uh, Wall Wednesday, where you actually can do uh, wall, uh, um, wall sits and planks on Friday, where she's researching all these different planks. Well, that was a core part of my workout that I did with my trainer. So all of it, like just, well, she, now Melanie's saying, let's move 30 minutes every day, which I think is just in its intentional movement. So you have to actually be intentionally moving, like on the treadmill or outside walking, or having an intention for your movement. It doesn't count if you're just um, walking in the grocery store. So I think it's a phenomenal, um, opportunity. So you can go over to her channel, connect with her, and uh, make sure that you interact uh, in her, you know, on her channel because that's where she, you know you get to have sort of more, it's more of a support, I think, because you're joining a community. Now it's it's okay if you want to just kind of be a you know just a fly on the wall and just absorb it. That's fine. Wherever you're at on your journey. I just have found, I mean, I used to be like that. I would go into all of these places and I wouldn't speak out. I was so shy, but um, you know, I, and I just didn't want to be seen. I wanted to be invisible. Now I just go in and I'm just, uh, I just go ahead and I, I comment all the time and I try to participate in these uh, resources and communities because it helps me. Once you actually participate and you write down a comment or something, you virtually, you've stepped into that virtual room, that virtual space, and now you can get support. So you're like saying, okay, I'm showing up for myself, everyone. I'm here and I wanna, I'm here to learn and connect and I want some motivation. And so it's, you know, it's true, truly like a mastermind experience. And that's what I love. So, okay, so you've got Lori Fluffy Nomo with the um, HCG. Now she's also keto. She does a lot more than just HCG. So I think you'll like her channel because um, she's not just doing HCG. What I really get from her is she shows all this food prep. And because I'm cutting carbs, it really helps me. I'm getting ideas from her. So that's one resource. Uh, Polk Fitness, again, um, the free resources as far as getting a customized workout plan for free. <laughs> I mean, that's a no-brainer. And, um, and he even helps you with the macros. Uh, so uh, to me, if I was starting out, I would definitely be over there uh, knocking on his door. And then of course, Prin uh, Princess Ninja, she's just fun and she's very motivating. And if you're just gonna work out at home and you're wanting some motivation and to be feel like you're part of a community, 
you know, I would recommend Princess Ninja. Those are the three resources. So, all right, guys. Well, I'm going to run now, and I don't know. I think I'm going to fold all that laundry that I have and uh, call it a day. So, make sure if you like my video, give me a thumbs up and subscribe, and I will see you. Oh, and make sure you ring that bell, and I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> Bye.